like they were walking to their death. They were like, mm. I'd be like, yes, fight for me, queen. Yeah, spread out, don't hold hands. There's not time for that. It's not time for that. These are your four finalists. Give them one more scream. Now, before we go to the judges' critiques, we're going to do an over. Judges, we're going to do an overall critique of everybody. I feel it only appropriate to come full circle. So, I hope you all bought your library cards. Can't put it on, but the library is open. There's more cheering because you know what's coming. Are you ready for them to read? Because why? Reading is a little mini challenge just to fuck you right up. River Bridge, <laughs> check in, girl. Your library card is ready. Messy, unpolished. Fact. It's not Jemima Hanfo, it's myself. <laughs> Stunning, gorgeous, flawless, everything that I'm not. Go, oh, honey, who? You gotta read all these bitches. Oh, all of them. Yeah, that's what's up. Oh, was that just me? Oh, yeah, that was just you. <laughs> Come on, let's be honest, I hate the other two. Oh, oh did I say that out loud? Well, the library is open. But you ain't got your glasses on! It's just natural. Well, naturally come for Jemima, go. <laughs> Jemima Headful! <laughs> An upset. A B C D E F G. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Guys, give it up for rhubarb. It's tough to go first, <laughs> equally tough to go second. As a wild card, you didn't get to read these bitches at the beginning, so I'm very interested to see how you're going to go right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Rhubarb, this is like your fifth time back here. Just die already! <laughs> LGB, I mean XYZ. You look great. It's good to see you. Um... No, actually, it's not really good to see you. But thanks for coming. That was lovely. Jemima Handful. <laughs> I didn't even have to read you. Your dress is reading you for me. <laughs> I have it. Thank you, judges. <laughs> I'm here today! <laughs> Boys and girls, Jemima Handful for your confederation. <laughs> Rhubarb. <laughs> As you said, polished, together, <laughs> fat, definitely not you. <laughs> Mina. I'm uh, still fat. Yeah, well. <laughs> There's only room for one fat bitch. Amina. Amina. What? Well, you said there's only room for one fat girl. Amina. <laughs> you were referring to yourself, but you made fun without it. Yeah, you yeah, exactly. Right? I'm not very funny. Here again. Again. And again. And again. Get off the stage. <laughs> Give someone else a go. <laughs> Hi XYZ. I love these flaps. Are these ones showing today? <laughs> oh, I love a gaffer tape little chicken nugget sticking out the side. Wait, that's me. Give it up for Jemima Handful. <laughs> Last but not least. 
all the way from Nihon. It's XYZ. Yeah, I couldn't put them in either, so let's just pretend. Hold them like Maggie Smith does. She invented the language. Is it fashion? No. Okay. Time to read these hookers. Rhubarb. Rhubarb. She's wearing a sequin. Enough to distract me from this going on here. Careful or I'll push you off stage like Bambi. Amina, stop spinning around because I'm gonna vomit. Seriously, stop spinning. You need to stop. Please stop. You can't? Okay. Stop. Okay. Jemima. This one survived every single lip sync. Every one. Not everyone? I had a week off one. Yeah. Well, she, oh, right, yes. Well, there was a lot of them. She said, Ladies and gentlemen, Lydia Vanity is reading out of town. <laughs> Charlie Richardson Courtney wants his beard back. <laughs> Hi, oh my god, back to me. Thank you. Um, yeah, surviving every lip sync was quite impressive because judging by your screams, I think that app must be broken. <laughs> Did that make sense? Yeah. I can't do this, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so glad I'm not the drunk crazy person on stage. Give it up for XYZ. Yeah. Oh. If you were supposed to read them like your life depended on it, you'd be all dead. Take those Judges. Glasses. They don't deserve their glasses, they're all too nice. It's disgusting to me. Well. Speaking from cunty bitches, judges, what do you think overall of our four finalists? <laughs> I'm not reading anybody. I can't read. Stop pointing fun. Lazy Susan, how do you think our four finalists went? I think we saw some amazing fucking work tonight and we saw a lot of people taking risks but inside of their brand. We never lost sight of who you each individually were. And that I can say for all of you. Um, I'll be interested to see how this plays out, and I'm so fucking glad that I don't have to do it. So, I don't know, enjoy girls. <laughs> I'm just gonna sit back and enjoy my missed wood. <laughs> <laughs> Give it up for Lazy Susan. Note, Cruzy isn't paying her anything more. She's just drunk. <laughs> Aisha Buffet. Um, it was a really entertaining night, which was better than some of the other nights, so I was really happy, to be honest. And um, and I'm actually dying, so you guys did an amazing job for making me a little bit happier. Um, and just to the audience, please cheer for your favourite. Just because you, she's your sister girlfriend, if you thought she was shit, don't cheer for her. And I swear to God, the girl with the fucking whistle, I will shove it up your fucking vagina if you blow it one more time. Bitch. Each and every one of you is a true queen in your own right. You all wear a crown. <laughs> try it, girl. Try it. Yeah, don't try it. You'll regret it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As I said before, I was rudely interrupted. Each one of you is a queen in your own right. You all have a crown. It may not be actually physically here in our hands. No. Oh. Fucking <laughs> shady bitches. Mm. However, however, I you all should be very proud of what you've achieved in your drag career and on this stage during this competition. <laughs> You're all beautiful and thank you so much for giving us life each week. Thank you judges. Thank you. Now boys and girls, just to continue on from what Isa said, Dragnet All Stars is the best of the best of Dragnet. These bitches are the top of the game. They're professional, they're working, and they're here to figure out
figure out who is the best of the best and who is going to be the Dragnet All-Star representative for next year. The Dragnet All-Star wins $1,500 worth of cash and prizes from the Greyhound and Crew.